11, we're getting a better sense of when Portsmouth Public School students could return to the classroom. The school board mentioned three Mondays in April for different groups of students. Eugene Daniel explains what these recommendations mean. Let me be clear that the decision of reopening has never been about whether or not we as a division could reopen, but when we should open. Portsmouth Public Schools is looking to bring students back to the classroom. Parents, teachers, and board members got a first look at how in-person learning could be in a few weeks. It's one of the last school systems in Hampton Roads to have this conversation. It comes a time when we got to go back. We got to go back to school. Here's how it could look. On March 29th, all staff would return to class. The system estimates at least 60% of teachers would be vaccinated by then. Then starting April 12th, special education and ELL students would return to the classroom for four days of in-person instruction per week. The next Monday, pre-K through third graders would return to a hybrid model. The same for fourth through eighth graders the next week. Parents would be given the option, but under this plan, high schoolers would stay home for the rest of the school year. Are we still looking at the metrics or are we now kind of, you know, doing away with that and looking at everything else? In January, the board voted to hold off any reopening talks until the city had a positivity rate below 10% for 10 days in a row. Thursday, the seven day positivity rate was 16.8% according to the state health department. But Governor Ralph Northam has called for schools to reopen at least partially by March 15th. Several board members said the plan is thorough, but they remain on the fence. It's just my thinking as far as the danger of the pandemic, that still gives me no uh, the hesitation. The school division will send a survey to parents in coming days to find out how many want their kids in the classroom. The school system did not make a decision tonight. That vote is expected for its meeting next week. For 13 News Now, I'm Eugene Daniel.